Hi folks, welcome back to Harris Farm. Well, today we're gonna have a lesson in saving. My grandmother had a saying, waste not, want not. Today, we're gonna waste not some leftover bread. We're gonna make a great bread pudding. Um, we're gonna use Italian bread, leftover from Friday night's dinner, a couple of uh, slices of wheat bread, and a couple of slices of white bread. And in just a short time, we're gonna make something simple, inexpensive, and use the leftovers. We're gonna take three eggs. We did one can of carnation milk, three eggs, and we're gonna mix those up just a little bit. Make sure you blend the eggs good. Now we're gonna add some sugar, and you guys know my recipes well enough to know now I don't measure much. But I'm gonna show you, we're gonna use a small cup and I'm gonna put about three-fourths of a cup of sugar. And we are going to add a little vanilla flavoring and a little bit of cinnamon. And today, I'm going to use some chocolate syrup and some butterscotch syrup. I'm gonna set this aside while I get the bread ready. We're gonna cube it. Now we're gonna add the bread cubes to the egg batter. And then I'm gonna cut up a couple of slices of wheat bread. Now, we're gonna let this soak up, and then we are going to add a secret recipe. This is Savannah Almond Mix. This comes from a um, company in Savannah, Georgia that makes almond, praline, cinnamon, all kinds of different flavors, and specialty shops all around the area sell this. Um, I use it in my coffee too, which is just a great, great idea in coffee. And we just keep stirring this up. And then we are going to add some butter and a little bit of butterscotch and a little bit of chocolate syrup. And then we will bake it at 325 for about 35 to 45 minutes. Gonna add a little bit of cinnamon We are going to add some butterscotch. Now, again, using leftovers, then after it cooks, we're gonna actually just put the chocolate on top of it and um, glaze it with it. Simple recipe, bread, canned milk, three eggs, sugar, a little bit of the almond mix, and if, and if you don't have a store that has Savannah cinnamon, um, use some almond flavoring or and make yourself a simple syrup. You could do that. Now we're gonna add butter, and we all know I use real butter. Easy, simple bread pudding. We're gonna bake it for about 325, and when we take it out of the oven, great with a nice cup of coffee on a cold winter day. Thank you for stopping by Harris Farm.